Yeah, that's what I, that's where I was going to go next. Kind of similar parallels. Both coaching staffs going into year three at their respective schools. And I know here at LSU, the expectation is with the expansion of the playoffs to 12 teams, there's no excuse for you not to be one of those teams in the mix this year to, to be in the playoffs. Is that the same expectation at USC? I think it's mostly the same. I think the one area where it's a little bit different is that last season, number two under Lincoln Riley was bad. And I think anyone would tell you that it was disappointing. Uh, they sucked the second half of the season, and that was pretty rough to watch. And the program, or the team kind of unraveled in a way that makes you worry about the state of the program. So I think that at USC, there's always an expectation that you should be competing for championships, conference championships, national championships, in this case, college football playoff spots. But I think that there is a, a marker for success for this season that is a tier below that. You know, I don't think this team has to make the playoffs for fans uh, 